morning, good afternoon and good evening everyone. So today I got Redmi Note 12 Pro 5G. Code name is Ruby and this mobile came for to get installed the me dialer and also me sms application it could be done to install the indonesian region rom on your device after installing the rom i am using the me dialer having a call recording feature also you can see that and it is working perfectly also this region rom the indonesian region rom coming with the google messaging application here is it is and also me sms application now those of you who have redmi note 12 pro 5g they can get the me dialer by installing the indonesian rom how to do that watch this video and follow the step you will get the me dialer or indonesian region rom on your mobile phone do not forget to subscribe my channel tap or click the bell icon tap or click the select all thank you so much i appreciate that you must unlock the bootloader of your mobile phone first if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader you can watch the tutorial video uh, link provided in my video description unlock the bootloader first then you can get install the Indonesian ROM easily on your mobile phone now I must say that there are two variant available one China variant of Redmi Note 12 Pro 5G and one is global variant of Redmi Note 12 Pro 5G now those who are or who have having the China variant of Redmi Note 12 Pro if they are willing to install the Indonesian ROM then unlock the bootloader first install the ROM but you will never ever relock the bootloader uh, having other region ROM or any other customized ROM. The bootloader will remain unlocked with the China variant only. And whenever they want to relock the bootloader, then first install the China stock ROM on your China variant mobile phone, then relock the bootloader. And the global user like for example the mobile that i have is the global launch so i can relock the bootloader straight away after flashing the indonesian rom i hope you got my point these are the software that will be required for flashing the indonesian rom 14.0.3 currently available in future if you are watching this video whatever miui version of for indonesian rom available you can download and follow the steps like i am showing in this video and one more thing that in that me flash tool 2017 version requires for flashing after downloading me flash tool must extract it first in same folder and then open the extracted folder of me flash double click this file install it on your windows so the all the drivers will get installed automatically with this me flash this is the website where we can get uh, roms for redmi note 12 pro pro plus discovery 5g etc etc you can see that ruby is the code name of a particular redmi note 12 pro 5g come down here and look for the indonesian rom currently redmi note 12 pro 5g indonesia stable so click on the download other website will get open then come down just check this is a recovery we will not go for the recovery we will go for the fast boot rom file so just check the code name ruby and the device name then click on full rom the rom will get start so after when you have downloaded the rom the rear stock region rom of indonesia must extract it first in same folder double click the extracted folder to open it inside there will be one more folder and if you double click on this same folder all the flashing files you gonna see in the same folder go back and now this is the important thing that you must do otherwise you will get an error every time if you try to flash copy this particular folder which is having all the flashing file copy this particular folder from here and you must paste this folder in your c d or e whatever options you have but you must go for main hard drive partition i mean to say i have copied this folder from here and i will click on c drive i came out to the main root partition where i can see the windows folder program files folder and i will paste that folder over here must rename this folder if you did not then you will get an error every time just press f2 and come to the end of the file name and make it short just bring the cursor to m 
and that's it press enter so we have renamed we have uh, shot the folder name right now i will minimize this explorer and uh, we'll go to the desktop there here i can see that xiaomi flash which is installed already on my computer double click this me flash click yes on next window the me flash tool will get open if you want to see the drivers just click the drivers you must see all the files over here that means that all the drivers already installed close this window then click select and now we are supposed to go to that main hard drive partition where i have copied the folder i will click on this pc then i will go to my main hard drive partition that was c drive click the c drive or whatever options you were having and after clicking my hard drive main partition i can see that uh, the folder of indonesian rom ruby click on this folder and then click ok so me flash tool is ready to flash the rom file we must save all the internet, internet storage data this will format everything check your mobile phone battery must be charged to maximum like 50 to 60 or 70 percent then go to settings and uh, password security must turn off the screen lock then go back and in case if you are using me account sync your me account once and then remove it must remove it same way go to account sync sync your google account once and remove it now if the set bootloader is already unlocked they can you can simply power off the mobile phone this procedure requires a data cable now you have to use a good quality of data cable do not use old data cable the set must be power off we have to boot the set into fast boot mode for that press and hold the volume down key then connect the data cable with mobile phone and uh, in few second you're gonna see that the fast boot screen will appear then release the volume down key and here we go the fast boot screen appears i have uh, released the volume down key now set is booted into fast boot mode and connected with the computer coming back towards a computer screen me flash is ready now i will advise to select the clean all do not relock the bootloader then go to here and uh, click refresh the me flash tool will detect the mobile phone here and then click flash the flashing will get started it will take a time now just wait for it when flashing completes the me flash tool will show success and mobile phone will get restart you can disconnect the cable from the mobile phone and coming towards the mobile computer screen you can see that uh, the flashing took 299 seconds flash done you can close the me flash tool now and we are done from the computer and mobile phone will soon start booting into stock region stock indonesia region rom the first boot will take a time just wait for it MIUI 14 welcome screen appears now you can uh, complete the setup screen finally finally flashing went very well very perfect and i have got indonesia stock region rom on my redmi note 12 pro and i am getting the me dialer with call recording feature and also google messaging application and me sms application and let me go to about phone to show the about phone screen me ui 14.0.3 still the rom is on is on android version 12 but i will get update soon and this mobile came with the 256 gb storage you can see still the 256 gb storage and if i go to details and specs you can see that 8 gb ram plus 3 gb extendable ram and y12 and this is the model number if you got helped by this video do not forget to like the video do not forget to subscribe my channel take a good care of yourself we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye